So, what happens if Freya gets this mirror? Don't you think that you and me have other things to discuss, like us? No. What happens? She'd be unstoppable. Where's my horse? I sent it off. What was she doing that for? No horses, no tracks. We keep off the road out of sight. <laughs> so you're coming with me then? No, you're coming with me. Yeah, whatever you need to tell yourself, that's fine. From what I can see, your wee band won't do too well without me. Huh? Whatever power this mare contains, I'll no let Freya wield it. We'll find it, and we'll bring it to this sanctuary. And then you and I will part forever. Please. Well, if you don't like my plan, you can piss off. Well, that is charming. And you can piss off too, as you so eloquently put it, but that's not going to get rid of me. You're still my wife. We, we were deceived. The ice wall that Freya put between us, she showed us what she wanted us to see. Well, hey, what if I'm right? Do we not deserve that chance? It wouldn't matter. You'd leave again. We blind ourselves to the truth because we're weak, because we hope. But there's no hope for love. Love ends in betrayal. I and always. Well, I don't believe you. I know why you're not talking. Do you? Uh, you notice the sparks between me and Mrs. Broman? I don't know what to say, she's my type. Loud and angry. Well, that's what I'm used to, isn't it? Well, I'm awfully sure you'll have a good life together. Aye, aye, we would. There's a problem. Another woman. A bit taller. Not as pretty, mind you. She sounds far too clever to waste her time with you. Well, I remember this one time we were caught up in a net together. This was a, was a long, long time ago. Are you know the hero of every story you tell? Well, that's because I'm very brave. Which is why I'm going to save you from drowning. And how do you expect? There's some unpredictable autos around here. It's not me. You're a right pollute. So are you. <laughs> oh. <sighs> See that? I never miss. Saved us. 